Hello everyone, we are back with Glen Velvet Reviews and uh, I got the uh, cooktop installed as you saw before. Uh, you saw me wire it up or whatever in my other videos and you saw me install it in my uh, electrical box before. Now uh, I got it all hooked up. We're going to turn it on. We're going to do a test. We're going to do a water boil test. We're going to see how quick it boils the water. I'm going to boil two cups of water. This is at room temperature, which is about 75 degrees, 74 degrees or something like that it was. I'm going to dump those in each one of these, and I put them on the proper size that they're supposed to be on. Um, I didn't use the middle, which is the most powerful burner, the middle one. I did not use that. I'm using the side burners because uh, the pans fit uh, more properly on the side burners. So I'm going to boil two cups of water in each one of these pans. They are Cuisinart pans if you want to know the brand so you know uh, what I'm um, boiling in and you can see how quick it is at least in the Cuisinart pans. They do have magnetic bottoms. I did already test them out with a magnet. They do uh, have magnetic bottoms so they should boil water quickly. And um, that's it. So let's get the... Uh, I uh, got two cups, uh, 16 ounces of water. Let's get, the, let's get this in there. Turn on my phone as a timer and um, see how long it takes to boil water. Uh, like I said, I used um, the pans separately because there are two separate power grids on your induction cooktop. Uh, and that's usually with all induction cooktops. Is only, there's two or three different power grids. So this is two power grids pretty much on this cooktop. So that's why I have it separated. A one over there and one pan over here and now they're separated. Because if you had both pans on the same grid it would regulate the power and it wouldn't boil the water quickly and you would be uh, pretty much you know losing power but like I said it's made to regulate it because th that's how it um, separates it so all right let's get this started put the water in there and get this thing boiling get the phone on and uh, see how long it takes to boil this water Okay, let's hit these buttons and let's uh, away we go and let's see how long it takes to boil. Mind you, this one does not have a cover on it, so yes, it's going to boil quicker, but I don't have a cover for this, so I have to make it fair. Um, even though I'm not trying to really compare them, it's just for you to see and get a reference point because you're going to see more videos of me testing this thing out. This is just a reference point for you to see induction working at how it's working with two separate pans on, on the separate grid and seeing if it fluctuates fine and it cooks it I mean it boils the water really quickly so that's why I just want to do a test like this for you so you can make your own assumption on you know if this works for you or you like this cooktop or whatever you want all right so let's hit power boil on both then we're gonna hit the start on there and the start and let's get this going here's power boil now oh we gotta hit it on first sorry obviously we gotta hit it on now it's on. It's at zero, 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 zero. Sorry, I just got it yesterday. So you are, I am learning with you at the same time on how to use this. I don't even know how to use the timer yet. We're going to use that in the next video or whatever. Um, so there's a lock feature on here as well. I don't, don't even know anything about that. But what's going on right now is I um, just want to test this out for you to see how quick it boils and stuff. So it, it is going to sense the pans on there. So it turned off because I didn't have to turn it on. Let's turn it on again. And now we're going to hit power boil and power boil on each one. Alrighty, power boil and power boil. And start. It's a little noisy. It is very noisy, just to, just to let you know. But it's induction. There's a fan in there. It's cooling the computer. I get it. So, you know, that's what you're going to get. So, you have to understand that's pretty much how it's going to work. So, as you can see, I am almost boiling right now to a, a nice rapid boil. I don't know if you could see this, but you can see the ring of where it is heating up the most. So it's not completely even heating that I would think, but maybe the pan will, maybe on a different kind of pan and a better even cook. See, that's at a rapid boil, and you could see when the rapid boil happened at like a minute and what, 20 something seconds. 
So we're going to turn that off right now. And it instantly stops. This one is not boiling yet. This one you saw happened at like a minute and 20 something seconds. You can just see the video of when it boiled, obviously, at the exact uh, point that it happened. And this one is still not to a rapid boil yet. So it seems like this one's taking a little bit longer in the saucepan. Now it's starting to boil. Yeah, now it's, it's at a rapid boil right now. So it took about two minutes, two minutes and two seconds over here for it to come to a rapid boil. And you saw how quick it stopped. As soon as you turn it off, it's done. That's it. It, it totally stopped. So that's at a rapid boil and boiling water right now. And we're going to turn that off. And it stops instantly. And it was great. That was pretty cool. So that stopped. And um, we didn't turn on the exhaust fan because I didn't want to mess up the noise of uh, you hearing everything. I should have turned down the exhaust. I'm going to do that next. So um, let's stop that. You already saw when that boiled. So that was like, um, that was like, uh, what was that? Sorry. So that one, this one was like, what, a minute and 20 something seconds. And this one was two minutes and like two seconds. So it wasn't that, you know, it was a little bit far apart, but, and they're both two cups of water. This one's probably less powerful than this one. That's the reason why. I'm not sure the watt it is exactly. Uh, if, uh, if you ask me, I'll let you know. I'm pretty sure. This one in the middle is um, 3,800 watt. And then the, uh, some one of them are 1,700 and one of them are like 1,500 or something like that. So this one's the least uh, powerful one. So that's why it did take a little bit longer than this one. So that's it right now. That was just a review on how quick it boiled up and it boiled up very quickly. I'm very impressed. That was two, that was two cups of water and no matter what pan, I'm, they both boiled very, very quickly. So I'm pretty impressed with that. And that was on power boil which, you know, cooks it up really, really fast. So we got boiling water on both of these stoves, and it's perfect, okay? And that's it for the review of uh, Glen Velga Reviews. I appreciate you watching and seeing um, my new cooktop and uh, seeing a review on it. If you like it, maybe it'll work in your house, or maybe induction itself will work in your house, so you get an idea, and that'll be pretty cool. So any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to know. And also subscribe to my channel. Follow me on all my reviews on everything I pretty much buy and uh, my, uh, pretty much uh, everything I spend my money on to uh, help you guys out in your decision making on, uh, on your, on, uh, I don't even know. Damn, I messed that up. Yep, I'm going to have to cut that out.